Hi guys, how you doing? It's Levis from the A and O Show. Just wanted to make up a small little content for today, and just to announce what's upcoming this week. So, I just finished this weekend. Um, the season finale of Gen V is a show on Amazon Prime, which is a spinoff of The Boys. If you don't know what The Boys is, um, I'm going to do a deep dive later on into that show because I really, really love that show. It's uh, basically what superheroes would be like in the real life and what if they weren't really like superheroes and they're like murdering freaks, pretty much. Um, how do I say this? I just saw there's about eight episodes um the spin-off of Gen V and for me it was amazing. Um basically the main character is this girl who controls the uh, power of blood basically like whether if she has a cut or anything like that she could use blood as her power make people explode right from the inside or just literally get creative and do anything with blood and you're going to be seeing one of those crazy like raunchy scenes basically just like in the boys because this series is more it has no limits it has no burden it is you know you're going to be seeing you're going to be seeing for in the boys and in gen v you're going to be seeing scenes that you're probably going to be like well, i can't believe they did this on tv or streaming however you want to call it and it kept, it will keep you entertained, like, guessing, like, what's gonna go happen next, like, what am I gonna see next, you know, like, stuff that you're probably gonna have, be having nightmares on for the rest of your night, or gonna be thinking about for the rest of the day, so, it's a hilarious show, it's, dives deep into, as well, not just the superhero aspects, but, like, what it's like to be a human, what it's like, what is truly like to like be a person that is can be corrupted by power or corrupted by money and what are the consequences of people's actions and stuff like that so i really do recommend um this show i will be doing later on probably early next year like a recap episode by episode all right, so if you did like Gen V or you saw it, let me know what you think. Let me know, you know, what your expectation was. How did you think the show progressed? What characters did you like? What characters you didn't like? Tell me why. Just write it down all down in the comments below. For what's upcoming, since I did mention a little bit what's upcoming next year, I want to mention what's upcoming for at least this week. So... I'm going to plan to do a live stream, which I'm still experimenting. As you saw this weekend that I was live a little bit, but since I'm a new YouTube subscriber, well, content creator, um, I need more subscribers in order to do an actual live YouTube. So I've been working with this app that helps me um, stream for you guys on YouTube similar to youtube live but it's not really so i'm still playing around with that app i'm probably gonna play around with it a little bit more and hopefully by friday i will be able to you know do i'm gonna do a live with you guys and the live is going to be about a pre-concert that i'm going to because for my spanish people yo voy a ver la mike towers El viernes en Nueva York. So, en mi camino para allá, yo voy a estar aquí. Voy a estar aquí live para hablar con ustedes. Pero tú sabes, pregunta después qué música te gusta. Tú sabes que yo creo del concierto antes del concierto y esas cosas así. So, and for the people in English, like, 
I'm gonna be doing like a little pre-live concert for the artist I'm going to see, Mike Towers. And it's just gonna be a random, you know, me, me talking, you guys talking, you can ask whatever, answer whatever. I'm just gonna be killing time there, you know. Just uh, pre-concert expectations and uh, for the show Saturday, I'll probably have my thoughts on what the actual concert is, how it was and everything like that. Um, mostly the videos would probably go on TikTok individually as I've been doing. So there won't be any hazard here for some, I'll put some like clips maybe if I can, if I could figure out the music copyright and whatever the case may be. So I'm gonna be a little wary of that. But um, also, I am going to be doing my next movie review is going to be the Marvels. And I'm going to go and said to the other theater that I didn't go, the one in North Haven that has the recline, not the recliners, but the moving chairs and stuff like that. I'll be reviewing that movie next, you know, give you just like Five Nights at Freddy's, the uh, expect pre expectations my knowledge of the films and stuff like that and then just go into the post what i thought of the movie why did why i liked it why i didn't like it you know same process so that for right now is upcoming i will i am planning and it's most likely that i will be getting my laptop hopefully by thursday so Maybe before Saturday, I will get my laptop up and running. So at least the quality of the show will be progressing, as I stated. So that's a good thing. Then I could experiment more with the app, see how I'm going to do and, you know, get all that thing running. I told you guys that I will be ramping up the, um, I'll be ramping up the channel. Um, I think sometime this week, maybe I'll introduce my co-host if she has the time and, um, what else? Mostly that'll be that aspect yet. Like I said, for the shows, I will be reviewing Gen V episode by episode. This was like a little recap of what I thought of the series overall. So probably beginning... January, I will be I will be recapping Gen V episode by episode, but that won't be the first one that I will be doing. Um, November eleventh, I will be doing a TV show on Apple Plus, an Apple TV Plus, called Monarch. It is a show basically based on the world of Godzilla, and I'll be my first time seeing it, so it'll be the first reaction for me, first reaction from you. If you guys don't have Apple Plus, then that's fine. I'll be reviewing and just recapping everything that happened in the episode. So don't worry about that. Um, anything else? For right now, um, guys, please subscribe. Subscribe, share the content. Um, support the channel. I really do need more subscribers so I could be doing more on-hand stuff on the channel itself. Um, I've been doing a lot of research on how YouTube and YouTube analytics goes and what I, I want to be able to use some features, but in order to do that, I need subscribers. I need people watching, liking the content, you know, let me know what they think, comment down below, whether it's on my social media or messages, recommendations, you know, anything like that will be greatly appreciated. For those who did subscribe, thank you. Um, just do me a solid. Um, by Saturday, Sunday, like try to recommend at least one person. Like if you recommend at least one person to, you know, subscribe or anything like that. Trust me, we're only going to grow t in this together and it'll be the better the show and the quality, the more engaging it will be. So if you guys could just get me one subscriber from you guys that already subscribed, I would really appreciate it. Um, I'm going to try my best to promote my stuff around my social medias, whether it's on Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, Facebook, whatever the hell else I have. But those are the main four. 
and I will um, try my best to, you know, keep on doing the content as best I can, at least weekly, you know. So, for right now, that's it, guys. Thank you much. Thank you very much for the support. Thank you very much for the love. And I will see you guys mostly either Thursday or Friday. And oh, one last thing. I do have an extra ticket for Mike Towers. If anybody's interested in joining or tagging along with me for this upcoming Friday, it will be in New York. So... Just hit me up in my in my phone, messenger, comment, whatever, you know, and I'll respond. And just let me know. If anything, I probably could, I just don't want to lose a ticket. So, just message me on that. But besides that, that's it, you guys. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.